Hello, pandanus can also grow in mangrove forests, but typically pandanus prefer slightly higher places than normal mangrove plants. In that case, the stilt root of pandanus will help it to stay on this muddy and extremely unstable soil. So this plant demonstrates not only the ability of pandanus to grow in a mangrove, but also some interesting features of pandanus in general. So first of all, this is very interestingly cut places, which show that stem of pandanus is mostly consists of fiber. It does not form any wood, and this is the main function of steel root. So they are developed to support the growing crown, whereas the main stem cannot do it. The second is the way of how pandanus is propagated. First of all, it has multiple buds all over the stem, and these buds will germinate and form new plants. So new plants, vegetative new plants, are present along the old pandanus tree. Second, fruits of pandanus are very funny. They are big, big groups of flowers which formed kind of phalanx. So phalanx are female flowers which go together in such a dense way that it's very really hard to understand where will be end one flower and start the second one. So that fruit will come down and in the presence of ocean waves it will float somewhere else. But here some fruits landed right under me and they are germinated here. So look how pandanus fruit is germinated. So each phalanx looks like each phalanx germinates separately. And all embryos go from the bottom side of it, because top side is extremely hard. So bottom side is a bit fibrous and easier to penetrate for young plants, which will form root. I will plant it later. So these are features of pandanus, one of famous tropical plants. And this is a place in Okinawa. This is Okinawa coast nearby the mangrove forest on November 24. Thank you. It's a good place to grow.